Hey guys, we're back with another Pokemon unboxing card opening. This is the newest set on Broken Bonds, and it is still in the Sun and Moon um, generation, probably until I guess it's December is one either they'll start Sword and Shield or it'll be the last Sun and Moon in December and they'll do Sword and Shield in February I don't know but I'm really really excited for when they reveal all of the new Pokemon for the next generation for now we're still in Sun and Moon and we have all of the tag team Pokemon still. Sylveon and Gardevoir. This is uh, Reshiram and Charizard. Machamp and Marshadow. And on the top it's uh, Lucario and Mel Metal. Interesting to me that they're putting more metal in this set, so I hope I get one of those cards. So let's just jump right into it. Thirty-six packs, all fresh and ready to open. Okay, I'm going to shuffle them up because we all know what happened with the Sun and Moon expansion, and rather have them randomized. All right, we got two even piles here. So let's start with the Melmetal and Lucario. First pack, you guys, for Unbroken Bonds. Gengar jumping out of a surprise box. Cute Tora Cat. Looks like he's on the beach. Energy Spinner. with focus energy Riolu looks like he's kind of inside some type of medical facility we got a Porygon Inkay this kind of looks like a reprint uh, art looks very familiar to me. Oh, Caterpie. Some type of beautiful, magical little uh, field. Pretty flowers and a nice sun. We have a reverse hollow Gligar saying, hey guys. And a non hollow sand slash hanging out in the Tree. I 
nothing for the first pack, but that's all right. I'm gonna go right to the red side here, and we're hoping it'd be Marchetta and Machamp card. Again, it kind of looks like Marchetto's running away from Machamp. He's sort of like, I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you, Marchetto. War Turtle. Interesting pose there, War Turtle. Uh, Gloom. Taking a nap after a hard night of drinking. Haunter. Oh, that's a cute mischievous. Glamio. Uh, Growler. I like this sort of art style, the uh, drawing and hard outline around Growlithe, but he definitely matches this background. Some type of town, a small town with the church steeple or clock tower. Very pretty. Uh, Ghastly. Togepi, popping out of a backpack. Drowsy, just chilling in a tree, and a toga kiss hollow. It's a very pretty card because of the background. It looks like some type of sunset with mountains in the back, clouds. Quite a beautiful sight to be flying through if you're a Jubilee, Togekiss Pokemon. Definitely hoping to get that Rush Ram and Charizard tag team card. That would obviously be the most sought after card in the deck. Because of Charizard, of course. <laughs> Alright, we got a Graveler doing a little rolling rock smooth. Oh, a pretty Porygon too with all of the planets and the stars. Him. He's a baby and that's his mobile. He's just amazed at all of the colors and the planets and the stars. And the martial arts dojo. A tentacle. Aaron. A little sand shrill. Ghastly. Tangela looks like his little spaghettis are floating away in the wind. Cubone, reverse hollow. And our rare is a Green Ninja and Zorark GX. Very nice. Let's see. They have Dark Pulse, which 
does 30 more damage times the amount of energy attached. And Dark Union GX put two in any combination of Dark Pokemon GX and Dark Pokemon EX from your discard pile onto your bench. If this Pokemon has at least one extra energy attached to it, attach two energy cards from your discard pile to each Pokemon that got put on your bench in this way. Mmm, very nice. This sort of waterish looking um, designs coming out. This very dense slash in the middle. It's a pretty card. See, these two really look like they're working together. You know, they look like they're about to get right in your business and uh, take you down. That's a good tip. Metapod and go this trap Dust Island kind of looks like uh, Trash Island, but all right Sound it Coughing Coughing and our Lovely team rocket back there Lolan Diglett Subat Jigglypuff with a pretty flower lay Reverse Hollow Seal and Quag Sire chilling in the in the bay with a cruise ship behind him. Favorite manatee Pokemon. Green's Exploration Tyrogue Bratty Kick Once during your turn, you may flip a coin. If heads, put three damage counters on any one of your opponent's Pokemon. Wow. If you use this ability, your turn ends. Okay. I like that ability. Happening. Play a house seal. Once during your turn, you may flip a coin if heads deal 6 damage from one of your Pokemon. Okay. Our mischievous. Glamia. Glamia has a cute Finian toy. Growlithe. Ghastly. Togepi Reverse Polyrath 
and a hey guys we got the one we wanted it's the rush ram and charizard gx see again these two look like they're working together they're both shooting out their fire uh, onto my hand or whatever this enemy is right here uh, so they have our age this attack does 10 more damage for each damage counter on this Pokemon. Flare Strike. This Pokemon can't use Flare Strike during the next turn. Okay, so 230 damage for that one. And Double Blaze GX. If this Pokemon has at least 3 extra fire energy attached to it, in addition to this attack's cost, this attack does 100 more damage, and this attack's damage isn't affected by any effects on your opponent's active Pokemon. So you could potentially do uh, 300 damage with this attack if you have 6 fire energy attached to it. That's a high cost for 300 damage. But of course, a beautiful guard and I'm very happy to get this. So far, we're having very good luck. Leffa, um, he's sticking his tongue out. Her tongue. His tongue. Uh, excitable draw. Once during your turn, you may flip a coin. If has, shuffle your hand into your deck. And then draw six cards. That's a pretty good ability, I'll admit. We have Happeny again. Trash Island. Pikachu. Pikapple. Pikachu looks cute, and we'll keep Pikachu off to the side. We have a Murkrow. Rhyhorn, pretty good action card. Oh, Meltan, why are you running away? I think Meltan escaped. You can see he was plugged in back here to something. And there's this little plug, and he's just running. Oh, little fat belly melts in. So cute. Slow poke. Reverse spritzy. And a blacephalon. Ultra beast. Fireworks Pokemon. Let's see, blazer and fireball circus. Interesting. I haven't really seen an Ultra Beast as like a regular rare card before, so looks pretty cool. I can dig it. Tyrogue. Stealthy Hood. Chatot. Spiral. That's a very similar hug to the Growlithe card. Very pretty. Jigglypuff. Krabby. Riolu. 
escaping from the medical facility. Hesper taking a nice afternoon sleep under a tree. Pollywag Rivers Hollow and the rare is a hypno. I like this art style. I already feel like I'm being hypnotized by this soft glow and little artifacts in my vision. power plant. Maybe Riolo is actually escaping from the power plant instead of the medical facility. Hmm. Layer on. Green's exploration. Carvana. Looks like he bust took a big bite out of that ship up there. Lit. Clefairy. Seal. Looks like seal spending some time in the Arctic. See some ice flows up there. Gligar. Saying, hey, welcome to my cave. I like this heart and to have it in a reverse album. Bray God, too. And. A very gluttonous looking licky licky. Okay then. Alright, he's happy. You know, I wouldn't wish to have a giant tongue that won't go inside my mouth, but um, he has tongue NATO. This attack does 60 damage for each head. That is strong. You could potentially be doing what to. 140 damage with just for three energy cards if you get lucky at least And we have a fairy charm, looks like a thunder fairy charm. Lightning fairy charm. Polyworld, feeling victorious. A de evolution spray. A Vino Nod, it looks like Vino Nod just wants a hug. You get a belly rub if you're not. Ratata is saying, get out of my ball pit. Or my berry pit. <laughs> Can't tell. A gold team. Dalamaka looks like one of those clay. Or putty, or uh, what is that? Um, Sculpey. Little Sculpey Daramaka hanging out in the grass. Another one, a sand dial. Ooh, I like this card. Reverse Hollow Rare Gengar. 
look at all of these abstract shapes and magic going on. Even his eyes have this red coming out of them. Very nice. And our rare is a large tangrowth with his slugs all chilling in the shade. All right. Here's my crochet card, a Pukamuku crocheted. Looks like he's on the beach with some more of them in the background. I have to save that one. And a fire crystal. Weeping bow shooting out some venom. Bow sprout. Diglett, Polywag under the water now, Rhyhorn taking a nice sip from this stream, here's our Growlithe again, and I think it is the same artist, Tetsuo Kozumi, you can see it's the artist on the bottom there. Reverse Hollow Vigavolt. And that's a rare. And our last card is a Meow Stick having a beautiful stroll through the garden with a fancy looking gazebo back there. We have an electromagnetic radar, a frogadier, beast bringer, porygon, little dharmaka again, caterpie. Ooh, Atkins. Lots going on in here. I don't know what he's doing. Either falling or coming in. Reverse Hollow Arbok. Quite a different art style between those two. And, ooh, a Mewtwo. I guess this one's on a hollow, but... Very cool. Looks like he's in some type of crystal cave. Maybe some carpings back there. We'll save that one. Oregon to Dojo. Lots of fireworks or electricity going on back there. 
and then a pod. Vena net. Ratatan. Goldine. Dharmaka. Sandow. Alright, we got a reverse hell of a geodude hanging on to some rocks. And our rare is the Genesect. Really going through the sky on a mission. I always thought Genesect was a cool Pokemon. He's like a insect fighter jet. Triple Acceleration Energy Energy Spinner Rhydon Team Rocket Controlling this Rhydon Carvana Savage Pokemon I like that name Litten A fairy seal Gligar Surprise Box Servers Hollow and a Doug Trio, not hollow. I might have jinxed myself, you guys. I said we're having good luck and now we have had Terrible luck. Please, Pokemon gods. <laughs> Give me a little more than that, please. Stealthy Hood Jatot Rhyhorn Little Meltan Sparrow Yep, it is Tetsuya Koizumi It's the artist for these ones Licky Tongue Litten. Oh, we have a reverse hollow stilazzle. And a Gengar non hollow. We got this one in reverse hollow, which I quite like. I'm quite glad about.
here's a new card we haven't gotten. It is a Raticate. Looking very intimidating, I must say. Lieutenant Surge's strategy. Samson Oak. Tentacle. Aaron. Sandroom. Ghastly. Little Tangle. UK, Reverse Hollow, and an Agron non hollow. Fire Crystal, Weeping Bell, Surprise Box, Oddish, Cute, but over these, Oddish, Mischievous, Salandit, Glamio. Diglett, Versalo Aaron, and yay, the Hollow Vial Bloom. That's a really pretty hollow card. I like how they even put these little hollow bits for the spray pollen coming out. Vile Bloom's flower down. You can sort of see them there. Very nice. Once during your turn, you may flip a coin. If has choose asleep, burned, confused, or poisons, your opponent's active Pokemon is now affected by that special condition. Pretty good. Nice. Let me just have a look there. Koga's Trap, Dust Island, Pukamuku, Close Shade, Alolan Diglett, Slowpoke, Splashing in the Hot Tub, Litten, Sandshrew, Murkrow, Reverse Hollow Porygon, and a Polyrath non hollow. I think we already got this one too.
a war turtle. Gloom. Haunter. Heron. Seal. Carvana, Reverse Hollow Meal, <laughs> oh, that is a cute card, hugging his little plushies, and the um, ability on here is Catter Day, draw two cards, if you do this, Pokemon is now asleep, <laughs> how cute, and an Alolan Doug Trio. We got a Welder, Lairon, Gliscor, a couple Pokemon we haven't gotten yet, hanging out of the tree, a Porygon, Daramaka, Caterpie, Kani, Reverse hollow polywag under the water and a wiggly tuff with a couple of jiggly puffs next to him. How cute. A fire crystal, de evolution spray, Togetic, oh, in this beautiful dappled sunlight with some nice little red flowers nearby, Bell Sprout, Diglett, Polywag. Rhyhorn, Growler, Reverse Hollow Venomoth, and a Stun Fisk, Non Hollow. Raging Thunder and Electric Trap. couple of packs. By some magic I put all of the good packs on top. 
All right, so polywhirl, de-evolution spray Z, metapod, Esper. Oh yeah, Esper also has Gatter Day. Squirtle. Yep, that's that same artist, Tatsuya Koizumi. I really like this style. Squirtle is looking rather plump, too. Rhyhorn. Ratata. Goldeen. Reverse Hollow Oddish. And a Crabominable with this sort of crayon like art and a crayon like background with stars and mountains. Who would have thought that you can take the Abomino Snowman and a crab and just be like, hey, that'll be a good Pokemon? Hey, I like Crabominable though. I think it's also say that Chandelure is one of my favorite Pokemons too. Exploration, Venonet, another uh, Sculpey Pokemon, Meowth, Geodude, Porygon in the water, hopefully it doesn't short circuit, Froakie, solving some sort of puff. Reverse Hollow Cottony, and ah, oh, here we go. We got a full art Janine. Look at the top four cards of your deck and put two of them in your hand. Shuffle the other cards back in your, to your deck. That's a great supporter move. And wow, I always love, love, love these full art trainer cards. Always oh, so beautiful. Ah. Check out those beautiful pastel colors in the background. Ah, so beautiful. All right, so we got something. We got something. I think typically the odds are. A ultra rare every eight cards, I think. Eight packs, I mean, and a rare every four packs. Start with the chat dot Mulane Frogadier Spiral Jigglypuff Krabby Riolu Esper Reverse Hollow Crab Roller, a little boxing crab, and a non hollow Arbok.
electromagnetic radar Frogadier Beast Bringer Krabby Tingala Oh yay, we got another crochet Pokemon This one actually might be knitted You can see that the way the rounds are going Sorry, that was too close, you couldn't see anything Looks more like knitted than crochet, but all the same, I love them. I'm gonna save this one too. We have a whooper hanging out in some very green looking water. Cottony. Versalo Caterpie. And uh, a Staka Taka or Versalo. Another one of these regular, sort of rare, Ultra Beast cards. Our surveillance building Pokemon. Another electromagnetic radar. Kalefa. Mm. Oh my goodness, there's like an oddish broken pot in the background. Ooh, ooh, is that a oh um Swablu? I can't tell. Kalefa, what are you doing? You're just spilling all the candy. Giovanni's exit. Litten Froki Crab Brawler Oddish Squirtle Reverse Hollow Licky Tongue and ooh, ooh, a Gardevoir and Sylveon GX number 205. 214. We're getting pretty lucky with these GX uh, cards. Another one where they do look like they're actually tag teaming. I felt like the last set team up, they were, they kind of looked like they were running away from each other. I didn't care for the way that some of them were framed, but all of these have been perfect so far. So they have fairy songs. Search your deck for up to two fairy energy cards and attach them to your bench Pokemon in any way you like. Collide a storm. Move any number of energy from your Pokemon to your other Pokemon in any way you like. And it does 150 damage. And they have Magical Miracle GX. If this Pokemon has at least three fairy energy attached to it, your opponent shuffles their hand into their deck. Ooh, 200 uh, damage that one does. Beautiful. I love Gardevoir and Sylveon, both of them are so cute. We got a Fero, Graveler, Metal Core Barrier, Salandit, Coughing, Lolan Diglett, 
Zubat, Jigglypuff. Oh wow, I love this card. Reverse Hollow Aromatize, surrounded by this border of climbing roses. It's a pretty pungentum and miraculous cologne. I'm going to save this one. And a victory bell upside down looking. No. Interesting. Interesting position you're in there, victory bell. You're probably my one of my favorites because this is the, uh, this is the pitcher plant, uh, Pokemon. Metal Corp Barrier Tentacruel Ultra Forest Cardinal Void Pikachu Murkrow Rhyhorn Meltan Slowpoke. Oh, now this is one I get to keep. My reverse hollow knitted oddish. And a sea king. Oh, how beautiful. How beautiful with this. Details in the fin. King is swimming through some kelp. I love this. It's so pretty. Showing a lot more realism than what we're normally used to. Could be because of the new Pokemon Detective Pikachu movie. Some of these cards have a lot more realism. Janine, Triple Acceleration Energy, Fairy Charm Ability, Grubbin, Little Sculpey Grubbin, Ghastly, Gligar, Spritzy, Do Duo Reverse Hello Haunter and a Persian with Gathering of Cats. Ignore all energy in the attack costs of each of your Pokemon in play that has the Catterday attack. Nice. You could really make a nice cat theme these cards. We have a Torah Cat, Energy Spinner, 
charge a bug, polywag, inke, tentacle, drowsy, cubone, reverse hollow rye horn, and a volcania. Hollow and rare card. Not as many little details in the hollow of this card, though you can see the wheat or fire. Um, it is a little bit more hollowed on the bottom there, so if I can show it, it's sort of hard to see, but those are kind of more hollow. And we have Flare Starter. Search your deck for a fire energy card and attach it to one of your Pokemon. And High Heat Blast. If you have at least four fire energy in play, this attack does 60 more damage. So 110 damage total. Alright. Another hollow to go into the pile. Giovanni's Exile, Dusk Stone, Litten, Froakie, Crab Brawler, Oddish, Squirtle, Reverse Hollow Riolu. And a Kingler having his aerial moment on top of the rock with all of the water back splashing behind him. He can feel like a mermaid too if he wants to. Okay, guys, don't judge. Charge a bug. Chip chip ice axe. Samson oak. Clefairy. Polywag. Atkins. Drowsy. Pikachu, Reverse Hollow Salandit, and Persian GX. <laughs> very, very nice. Check that out. I don't think I've seen a Persian GX card before. Or EX. Uh, once during your turn, if one of your Pokemon GX or EX was knocked out during your opponent's last turn, you may search your deck for up to two cards and put them into your hand. Vengeance. This attack does 20 more damage for each Pokemon in your discard pile. Ooh. But you can't add more than 100 damage in this way. And switch this Pokemon with one of your bench Pokemon is Slashback GX and it does 150 damage. Alright. Very cool. 
I love cats and this is cute. Big action shot with Persians. Sharp claw marks coming in right here. Cool. Alright, so this is the home stretch. Looks like only five more cards to open. Five more packs. Triple acceleration energy. Fairy charm ability. Do duo. Polywag. Spritzy. Licky tongue. Vino net. Reverse Hollow Tangrill and a non hollow crocodile. Crocodile. Alright. One more. Okay. Alright, Golbat. Tentacruel. Poke Gear 3.0. Whooper. Sandile. Meowth. Grubbin. Geodude Triple Acceleration Energy Reverse Hollow And Ah, uh, check it out We got the Melmetal Hollow card Alright, Metal Eaters Its ability Once during your turn you may discard A Steel Pokemon from your hand If you do, heal 100 damage From this Pokemon and heavy impact. Very nice. Mel Metal. You would think he would have higher HP than just 150, but it's alright. Alright. So we got three more. So far, we had a pretty strong start, a weak middle, and we've been ending pretty strongly, so I'm glad. I was kind of worried this whole box was going to be a real bust. Alright, so Dusk Stone, Haunter, Lieutenant Surge's Strategy, Whooper, Sandile, Meow Grubbin Geodude Reverse Hollow Ghastly and Clefable Non Hollow. Alright, which one's the lucky one? Save that one for last. And open up this one. Sam 
sun oak. Janine. Crab brawler. Sand dial. Our little Oddish again. Subat. Coughing. Reverse hollow licky licky. And, oh, you guys, this is a good one. See which one it is. Aha, we got the Rainbow Rare Haunch Crow GX with the Ruler of the Night. As long as this Pokemon is your active Pokemon, your opponent can't play any Pokemon Duel, Special Energy, or Stadium cards. Hmm. This attack does 30 damage to two of your opponent's bench Pokemon GX or EX with Feather Storm. And unfair GX. Your opponent reveals their hand, discard two cards from it. So I guess you can look at their hand and decide which ones to discard. Ooh, mm -hmm. Very cool. Haunch Grow GX Rainbow Rare. what I saved for last. Koga's Trap, Power Plant, Charge a Bug, Cubone, Riolu, Porygon, Inkane, Caterpie, Reverse Hollow Squirtle, and our final card is... Oh! Oh, a Daydene GX. I love Daydene so much. He is the cutest little Pikachu ripoff Pokemon, but honestly, he's not a Pikachu ripoff. He's his own little cute little guy. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, how adorable. He has day to change when you play this Pokemon from your hand onto your bench. During your turn, you may discard your hand and draw six cards. Static Shock, 50 damage, and Tingly Return GX. Perfect. Tingly Return. Your opponent's act in Pokemon is now paralyzed. Put this Pokemon and all cards attached to it into your hand. Oh, I shouldn't say you're a Pikachu ripoff data name. To be honest, it makes sense that in this world of Pokemon, there would be kind of like related species of Pokemon, you know, similar types of Pokemon. Like Minin and Plusle are kind of in this mouse category of Pokemon, just like in our world. Oh, yay. Well, we started really, really strong, and we ended really, really strong, so I'm happy. And I got that Reshiram and Charizard tag team card. So, thank you guys for watching, and thank you for always supporting these Pokemon videos, and I really like uh, doing them for you all, so bye guys.